Welcome back to a new episode of TBH. I'm your host, Jay Specialist from TheBeerHeads.com. Let's get into today's episode. Today's a special episode. This is my 300th review, and I'm going to be doing a big beer. You can already tell what it is. We're going to be going to Truckee, California to be a big, huge rarity beer from the 5050 Brewing Company. It is our 12-year, 2012 edition of the 12-year Elijah Craig Barrel edition of the year Eclipse. A 9.5% ABV Imperial Stout brewed with honey. Let's get this into a glass and I'll let you know what I think of this one, you guys. Right, the appearance on the 5050 12 year Elijah Craig. Definitely getting a nice, you know, black opaque, subtle dark brown, light ruby red hint, tints on the bottom of the glass. One finger head dissipated real quick of a khaki head. You're going to expect that for something high in alcohol and barrel age. Um, you get a subtle haze quality to this. It looks a little bit different than being that dark opaque black. It's more hazy dark black brown. Um, you're going to expect that from the bottle uh, being barrel, the beer being barrel aged. Um, definitely getting a huge, nice alcohol legging, just falling on down from the glass. Just nice in appearance. Can't wait to get into this one. The nose on the 5050 Brewing Company's 12 year Elijah Craig Eclipse Barrel Age. Yeah, it, it's there. It's there. This is barrel age. Big time. You get those nice vanilla, oaky qualities, dark chocolates, roasted coffee notes, subtle sweetness. You can definitely get that little subtle honey in there. It's not too big, but you definitely see a nice smell of a honey body quality. A little bit of a caramel quality toffee. A subtle alcohol, but not too big in the nose. All right, the taste on the Elijah Craig 12-year barrel edition of the Eclipse from 5050 Brewing Company and to my 300th review, cheers. Holy shit. Wow. All right, this is, wow. That's a nice barrel-aged uh, Imperial style right there. I've had some. Amazing barrel aged edition period sauce with this by far right here. Wow The barrel is really playing a good part on this one. If you don't know Elijah Craig is basically uh, distilled out of the Heaven Hill distillery in Kentucky 51% uh, of the bourbon barrel bourbon is a uh, corn mash So it's 51% corn and the rest is a blend of uh, different malt uh, grains barley whatever uh, 12 year Elijah Craig if you haven't had it uh, comparison to uh, sweeter bourbons, this one gives off a more of a sour mash quality, uh, soury taste, but it's still you still get the spice complex qualities from the 12 year of the Elijah Craig. If you haven't had it, um, plays a big part on this beer. You get all the base beer qualities in Imperial Stout, especially with that the part that's brewed with honey. The honey gives a nice texture to the mouthful, gives it a medium to medium high body, um, full body. Definitely getting some nice carbonation in the mouthful. The mouthful gets a, a nice velvety texture from the honey. Plays a nice silky part. Um, complexity wise for this beer, it's freaking ridiculous. Up front, you pick up the sweet vanilla, chocolatey, cocoa nib like qualities. In the middle of the palate, you start moving on. And it gets to that sour and corn mash quality. It's pretty crazy. It plays a part with the barrel. It soaks up a lot of that barrel. Uh, from the Heaven Hill, and Heaven Hill does produce a lot of good bourbon. Um, this thing's crazy. Um, you pick up uh, nice toasty qualities, um, dark chocolates, cocoa nibs, sweet textures of honey, uh, almost a, a subtle um, uh, corn sour mash feel to it in a way from the bourbon barrel. It's pretty intense on how much it soaks up the barrel, um, just for the fact that you can only use a, a bourbon barrel once when you do bourbon. So it's pretty fresh barrelizations of what they do with this. It's crazy. You do get a subtle alcohol heat from this one, but it's it's balanced nice. Roasted malt coffee, um, dark malt, just 
toasty qualities. Jesus Christ, this is fantastic. You got... I'll get to the verdict. The final verdict on 5050 Brewing Company out of Truckee, California on their Eclipse 12 Year Elijah Craig Barrel Edition. Without a shadow of a doubt, you guys, come on, this is fantastic. Um, minus the hype of about the Eclipse series, just minus that. The way this beer plays, you know, the base beer is there. You can definitely pick up all the base beer qualities of an Imperial Stout, what to expect to get from it. And then you get the Barrel Age Edition qualities from it. And it doesn't overpower the base beer. You still get that nice complexity of the two between. Um, you still got some heat on this one, and it's still sitting well. But that heat is balanced out by everything that you get from the dark malt, chocolate, the oak, the vanilla. Um, everything about this beer is just hands down fantastic, and it's an enjoyable beer. I definitely say check it out. Uh, it is definitely a treat to get uh, once in a great while. And it's something I will say I will definitely try to get a couple other uh, their barrel age series because this thing is sitting in and drinking right, you guys. But until the next time, like all I say, live, learn, and drink. I'm going to enjoy my beer until 400th review. You guys have a good one.